Hello, I'm Vicky. We have been trying out the micro trike for quite a few weeks now, so I thought it was about time that I came on here and shared my thoughts about it. We already have a pink micro scooter, which my eldest absolutely loves. She is three and a half, just over three and a half, and she's had it since last Christmas, so since she was just about to turn three. I would say she's using it more and more now, as you can see. Hello, you having fun? Go back outside. I'm gonna scoot. I'll scoot. As you can see, she loves it. My youngest really likes it as well. She is now 18 months old, and I think we're probably gonna get her one for Christmas because she's so obsessed by it. Now, the micro trike. At first, I thought the micro trike was kind of like more of a toy type thing, kind of like the scooter but it's a slightly more practical thing for, one for the grown-ups really, but also fun for the kids. So it's basically meant to be a bit of a replacement for your buggy, a lighter weight alternative for when your kid has just started to walk or just started to toddle. So they're around 18 months, they're, they're getting their confidence with their walking, they get tired quite frequently. You maybe are going on a day out and you don't want to bring a really, really big heavy buggy. This is a fantastic alternative for that. It only weighs 4.9 pounds and it is, honestly, it is so light. The trike also folds down so it's really slim and nice and compact for taking with you on car journeys, you can stick it in the boot really easily or you can even chuck it in a big uh, carry, carry hold all or something, chuck it in a big bag and carry it with you over your shoulder. Um, so it's really good for going away for trips, weekends away, that kind of thing. The micro trike that we were saying has got a safety harness on it as well. So you can strap your child in and know that they're not gonna go falling out. You know, if your kids are anything like mine, they are constantly changing their mind about whether they want to be in the seat, out the seat. So this just kind of stops that. Um, the handle here is adjustable, so you can have it whatever length you want it to be. The footrest down here is adjustable for your child. So as their legs grow, this grows with them. It's so lovely and easy to steer. Very, very comfortable to push. And because it is so lightweight, obviously it's just, an absolute breeze to manoeuvre left and right. This makes it really easy to get around tight corners. So it is perfect for going around the shops with a young child. In my view, the one downside with the micro trike, and this is just from my own personal perspective and the situation I'm in, I have got a 18 month old and a three and a half year old. Three and a half year old does still sit on the buggy board quite a lot because her legs get tired. So if we were to completely replace our buggy with this, then it would be a problem because I would end up carrying a bag, pushing this and probably carrying my three and a half year old as well, which would be a bit tricky. So I feel like I still need a buggy with a buggy board. But I think if I were going out and about just with an 18 month old on a regular basis, I think this is fantastic. If you don't need a huge basket in the bottom of a buggy, if you're quite happy just to um, carry your bag, then I think this is such a great alternative, especially if you're going on, you know, like really awkward journeys, like on the tube or on a bus, where having a big hulking buggy is actually just really cumbersome and holds you back quite a lot. This is a really fantastic secondary option to that. Now, I said earlier that I kind of initially assumed it was a toy and it's actually one for the grown-ups. I mean, my little girl does love playing on it. She does love sitting on it. She'll frequently put toys on it and push them around on it. I have to say, when it comes to the micro scooter versus the micro trike, the scooter does win with the kids. My two are way more interested in playing on the scooter than they are with sitting on the trike and being pushed around. I think that as my youngest is just sort of watching her big sister a lot, she's growing up a lot, she just wants her independence and with this she doesn't push herself around but with the scooter she does. So this is definitely one for quick trips to the shops, um, if you're going on holiday, if you're going on the underground, it's perfect for that. If you're looking for something that's going to entertain your child, I would go with the scooter. Okay. The micro trike costs £79.95. It's available on the micro website, but various other retailers do stock it as well. 
It's available in a range of colours. I've got it in pink, but it also comes in black, blue and silver. So whatever your child might prefer or you might prefer. For me, the biggest selling point of the Microtrike is that it's ultra lightweight and compact. There is nothing else like it on the market. Even the lightest of buggies on the market do not fold up as slim as this, do not weigh as little as this. So for popping out to the shops quickly with a small child, it is just fantastic. Okay, so that is my verdict on the micro trike. Have you given it a try? I'd love to hear what you thought of the trike in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.